Hey everyone, Chevy Gaming here, and welcome back to some more Final Fantasy XV. We are still here in Stalith. There's four in there. There's four Ronins in there. That is annoying, isn't it? Well, let's go. This is how you get your XP. You have to fight these Ronins. The Ronins are actually really good for XP. We've been getting like 20, 20 odd thousand for three of them, so we should do pretty well in here. We just need to get one or two of them down as quickly as possible and get the numbers game on our side. These guys do a hell of a lot more damage than we can ever imagine, and they get a lot more health than we can, so we need to get the numbers on our side instead. That is just as hell. Just, they're just so bloody powerful, as you can see, by just wiping out everyone first time. I'm about to get wiped out. For God's sake, I'm spending the entire fight just giving people bloody Phoenix downs. I wish they'd use them themselves, to be honest with you. And that's what I like about Final Fantasy XII, and I'm hoping when they re-release Final Fantasy XII later on this year, that they keep that... That they keep that whole thing where, um, where you can set up gambits, because that, that was one of my favourite things to do in Final Fantasy XII. You can set it up to say, when somebody goes under a certain health amount, then give them a potion or when somebody goes into a certain health and cast heal and Gladio. having a full-time healer as well that's the one thing i've not liked about this game is that i like having roles i like having classes for each character and that's something that i do in a lot of games like with warcraft and stuff like that sort of stuff like that where you have um you have a healer you have a tank you have damage you have support and that's one thing this game doesn't really have that a lot of the other Final Fantasy is used to. Like Final Fantasy XII, Final Fantasy XII was great because you had to create, you based your own game. Depending on how you went down the skill tree, you turned them into certain person. People had pretty good base stats for certain things as well, so you could create them into like a tank, for example, or um, or a damage dealer. A tank basically would be someone who would go in there. And essentially get all the aggro. So basically, all the bad guys will be focusing on attacking the tank or anybody else. And then that allowed everyone else the chance to go forward and attack. Sure people I'll prove it. I want these moments to be dead. Right, do it. Oh, finish. Finish them. I've, unless one of them is there. That's crossing the line. I only saw three in that camera. Well, there we Sorry, go. One of them definitely down. Down. Oh no, there is three. But this one there is vulnerable. I'm gonna take that vulnerable away. Yep. Front Got it! Blindside link, come on. Oh wow. Yeah. A hell of a blindside link. Yeah. Yeah. Limit strike damage there. Watch ya! We'll do some more AP to some more of these guys. That's that. Nothing goes through. Gotcha! Right, nothing going down. It's the last one. Oh, thank God for that. Nearly 40k for those. I'm comfortable Excellent. just being alive. That is what I want to see. XP out the years. I said, I said I was aiming for around about 1.2 million after this dungeon, um, and we might actually get towards that now because if we're going to get like 40k for Ronins, and we've got oh, one of these buggers again. I hate these things so much. Right, are you ready, guys? Are we all ready? Let's oh! Whatever that is, it's disgusting. Quit crying. You're right. Now. Right side. Coming up. Oh, well. Yeah. I ride the back side. How is that not a blind side? Yeah. 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 Stay alive. Yeah. 
Gladio with cheeky death blow and he's still got half health left. Chance to use that uh, petrification. The thing is, I, the Ronins are really difficult. These things are difficult to kill. They take ages to take down, and you end up using a lot of healing items. But at least the Ronins give crack and XP. These don't. I think it's like a base of five days. Ah, will turn. I can do it. I can do it. I can do it. Yes, it's going. My hands are getting a little clammy. It's hard it works. Well, I thought it worked. Huh. On cover! Yeah. 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 Yeah, she's vulnerable at the time as well. That's perfect. Nothing personal. That's all A's as well for a change. I, mean, I feel we did do quite well in that yeah. part, actually. I need for. I thought we had that all time. We're alive! Let's celebrate by eating. Ah, these something are good. Dead. I like these. Uh, not a fan of most of the sorts. Get back! Done in a minute. Despair. Nothing to it. Well, give some magic. 1.1 million. Okay. I need 100 more K to reach my target at 1.2 million. That means we would have got about 400 K from this dungeon. Oh crap! Three Tom. Okay, I've had a Sir Tombri. Maybe a Tombri is not as powerful as a Sir Tombri. Um. Oh, there's more times quests on, is there? Okay, they're back. Uh, okay, we'll, we'll, we'll look at that later on. Um, what we'll do? Element C. Right. Let's create some magic. Just for the sake of it. Because these Tombreeze are buggers, I think, to kill. We've got one the base coin. A podcast. Depends if we've got anything that's good for Xperia Cast, we'll do it. We've got five rare oh, I've got five rare coins. Come on, let's do that then. That'd be good. Yeah, put that in place that, because I don't think it work anyway. Not the time for horseplay! My hand slipped. He's got a knife! Maybe it's for. <laughs> Loads of damage and they're not, not going down. I see. And they took us out straight away. Disappointing. Oh, doubt that. Hey! Oh, the health is going down a bit quicker than what? How are we? Get by. They're, they're just so. I can't understand how they're so bloody strong. <laughs> Straight away. I heal Ignis and straight away he goes down again. And then I go down. Wow. Wow, that's great. Yeah. 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 Let's just hope they've got really poor health themselves. All better? Thanks. Watch this! Oh, just one hit over and over again. I 
can't handle one hit kills against us because we're just going to run out of healing items far too quick. Kill me in the middle of my armature. Watch yourself knocked. I know. Have I crashed or have I been. What's happened to me? You stuck me there. Okay! I'm jammed, there we go. I've been released now. I'm not being killed. Gladio! Gladio, please. Just kill one or two of them, please. We're sorely overmatched, Doctor. Let's huh? retreat it. <sighs> this has got to be worth it. An absolute ton of XP. <laughs> This is going to be an XP gold mine to make this worth it. Back me up! Uh huh! Strike him with full health and just get bloody knocked out straight away. Certainly didn't expect this much trouble. Doesn't look good. <laughs> Frozen in time. Yeah. Can't do anything again. That's what happened to me earlier, wasn't it? Gladium, do it! Oh, yeah. I just hate the way that they all crowd around me all the time. Hide this. have got to be worth it the boss is that's how tough these are I was actually considering there for a second that these are the boss Going quiet. It's just this is such a, uh, a bugger of a fight that we're just really having to go. Gladio, any last words? Gladio, please. Right. Some of them are getting low. They're all chasing me. It's just so frustrating, they're just so strong, these little buggers. How, if you actually came in here at level 86, like it suggested, how you're supposed to do this fight, I've got no idea. And if this fight is so difficult, there must be a, there must be a really easy way of doing this. You've got to kill that one, surely. Just take that one out. Yeah. 
Nice work, Gladio. Yeah. Screw you. Screw you. Yeah. So no health left. Yes, he's down. We killed one. Killed me with one bloody hit. I hate you. I don't know what I'm supposed to do, to be honest, because if I don't. I'm trying to stay away. I'm trying to stay away, and but then if I stay away, I'm not doing any damage, and if I go in. I'm getting knocked out first time. Gladio! Yes, it got into them all. Oh god, I thank god for that. I'm still not quite sure how I'm doing that. A Balmung. Ooh, okay. What is a Balmung when it's at home? Oh my god, it's better than the Ultima Blade. Initially, this sword delivers devastating harm, but as the wielder's magical energies decline, so does the blade's lethality. Okay, so it's stronger the more mana I have. It looks like a lot more powerful weapon. I can't believe it. I've actually got a stronger weapon than the Ultima Blade. It's like the Ultima Blade is like Woo! chapter two. <laughs> We're alive! Let's celebrate by eating something dead! Wow, that was a hell of a fight, that was. Those little buggers, I can't. If I walk in, I see some more of them now. It's another campsite, okay. You want to make camp? Which means we're still quite a chunk away from the end if there's another campsite. Do we want to make a camp again? No, I think we're okay for now. Our food's not that close to running out, so I think we'll continue on. I don't think we're in any danger of being killed just yet. Okay. I've got these. I can take these out with... Uh I now. Take these out of the ring as well. Although I wasn't actually in a fight with them. That's a shame. We won't get the XP from Watch yourselves, knocked. I know. So there's certain things that are really um, quickly effective against certain against certain enemies, but it's just trying to find out what's what. I want to try this new sword out. Killer wasps. Really? Again? The no one is your nice guy. Well, here we are. I think I took one of the wasps out. Together. Oh yeah, the wing. The wing does lots of damage. The wing. The ring does a lot of damage against those. Well, you know what? The ring's actually a lot more powerful than I ever gave it credit for. You know. It's really helping us through here quite quickly. I'll tell you what, the boss is going to be crazy in here, isn't it? Okay, some more of these fat chickens, we'll take them out. Time to book! Right! Done in a minute! Sing your prayers! Okay, all down. Back from the XP, I said 1.2 million. We're only 20k away from that. Right. That'll give us close to... Ooh, uh, close to 4 million XP, wouldn't it? More killer wasps. Good. How many times? Enough talk. Time for some action. Well, boom. Five. Four and a half k. Mega elixir. And what do we find? Is that what we found? A mega elixir. Okay. So these last few rooms have been quite easy. <laughs> 
some more. As long as the other guys take up the aggro, I can. Watch out! Down as well. All right, you hate bugs. I'll tell you what, the ring is Me? incredible for yeah. this period of the dungeon, is it? We're just walking through, just destroying things with this. What's in here? Ronins, okay. Only two? That's not too bad. Ready, guys? I'm going all out. Just don't. Oh! Straight away. Plowing in, blade first. Appreciate it. The last few rooms have been quite easy, but this one is uh, definitely going to take us back to where, it's... where we have been recently. Let's see what the new damage to the sword does. Oh, I'm not very good at it. I'm getting frustrated as soon as it becomes a little bit challenging. It's not very good. It's pretty okay, isn't it? I've currently done the difference here. I'm, get it. I'm sure there is a difference. That's crossing the line. One Ronin down. Nice work, Gladiator. Down, trying, to, trying to get behind him, but he's done well. He's got his back up against the wall. Yeah. 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 Huh. I'm starving to death, and yet we're all very much alive. The XP is rolling in now. That wasn't too bad. It's when there's like more, like like this room when there's four rows. Showtime. Not too tough. Because that happens over and over and over again. Oh, I, well, we're going to end up running out of the um, stuff in here. Honestly, all I can do is hold on to block and let him run. Literally my entire bunch of that. I'll just give you three elixirs, one after the other, and you just keep getting knocked out. I don't think it's worth giving you any bloody more. Nice. Good work, Gladio. Ignis, please try and last more than like 10 seconds. Okay. Ignis. He's vulnerable. Stop looking at him, take him down. Gotcha! First down. Let's get the numbers back on our side. Gladio's out now. Right, I've got my armor here as well. Apologies. We've got to take one out. Get back! I can keep this deal in check. Oh, 
XP. There we go. 1.2 million is I'm reached. Just being alive. Next coin. That all turn is really OP. I think. I don't know what triggers it, but it is really OP. It does a lot of damage, and it really helps us move on. Killer wasps, good. Poor guys in the room. These are not the type of bad guys I like to fight. What team do you like to fight? Not mention it. So guys, if you can just like keep these. I need you guys to keep these things occupied while I take them out. Get up. Give you one job to do. That's all I give you. One job. Keep you away from me for two bloody seconds. Where am I? I'm stuck. I'm like confused as well, aren't I? Don't get touched as all. Well. That's the one. Let's go! Oh, we need a couple of antidotes now as well. Indeed. <laughs> Get rid of the old poison. <clears throat> I don't know. I think it's a simple potion. Never gonna get used unless we really are desperate. Which by the end of this dungeon we might be we're using a hell of a lot of stuff. Right. Cox. Show it. Yeah. Say your prayers. You guys, again, just protect me while I take these brothers out. What you gotta do? Protect me while I take them out. Here I am. That's better. That was a good play. 26k, free XP. Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Down here. This is a much longer dungeon, this one. There's hundreds and hundreds of levels by the looks of it. Ah, oh, it's another campground. Oh, the last here. campground gave us a good weapon. What's this one going to give us? A mega elixir, okay. Uh, let's uh, let's refresh our food then. It's cool. I'm hoping we've got enough ingredients to make another rice bowl. I'm sure we will have another, enough ingredients to make another rice bowl. 70 hours in now. 70 hours. Right, can we make another rice bowl? Uh, well, come on, come on, come on. Can we? Where is it? Oh, we can't make one, can we? Oh, yes, we can. Yeah, so we've got another ingredient, haven't we? Some sort of soup, I think it said. Where is it? There it is. Um, HP boost, regen boost, replenishment, test bar. Okay, interesting. Ooh, increased experience by 50%. I didn't realize we had that. We need some ham and some root. Okay, we'll have to get some of that next time we go out and about because that could be handy in these dungeons. Um, but we're doing this one 30%, which is not bad, but it'll do. There we go. Extra XP by 30%. Uh, increased items found. And uh, extra 1000 HP as well. Yeah, everyone's at level 99. As you can see, everyone is going to level up at least once or twice. Which would be good because we'll be above level 100. And we got Mega Elixir Magnets for Gladia, which is good because that's a, an item we could really use. And I tell you what, we probably are going to end it there for an episode anyway, because we're right at the end uh, anyway, aren't we? So uh, we've camped, we're ready, we're fresh to go, we've eaten, uh, and now it's a case of continuing on and seeing if we can finish this dungeon. I think, from what I've read, it takes about two and a half to three hours to finish it, so I'm going to assume we're roughly halfway through, but I'm sure we'll find out as time goes on. Of course, if you have enjoyed this one, please let us know by hitting that like button, and of course, if you want to see some more, then hit that subscribe button as well. I've been Shabby Gamer, thank you very much for watching, and I'll see you very soon for some more Final Fantasy XV. Bye! Play by the same, the one to two.
Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.